Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I have my September melting basket. I have two melting baskets here, so it's a lot of wax. I'm just gonna go ahead and get started. I'm gonna try and do it by vendor as much as possible, um, but it might get a little bit messed up here and there. So starting off strong with Teddy Bees. So I pulled out a lot of my fall wax. What I think I'm gonna do is start the fall melting now, and then for October, I'm gonna have just a completely different like Halloween melting basket. And then in November, I'm gonna hop back into these two baskets um, and try to finish off most of these things before December, which is when I'm gonna bring out my holiday tree scents. But anyway, so from Teddy Bees, we have cider cookies. I'm not gonna go over scent notes because we'd be here forever. Um, also, it's September 6th or 7th today, and so I've actually already started digging into the, some of these. So some of them are partials, and some of them I've already emptied over the last week, but that'll be in my empties. Um, anyway, next up is pumpkin spice and cake batter. I got this in a de-stash last year. I haven't melted it yet this year, but I have about... Mm, a little bit more than half a tub left. This is amazing. It's like nothing special on cold, but on warm, this is the most delicious pumpkin spice dense cake melt, I mean scent ever. Pumpkin cookie jar, this is from last year and I have yet to melt it. Sugared chestnuts and apple butter. This is in her pre-order that's gonna open later today. Um, if you're watching this on Friday. Um, I have gone through, I went through a souffle last year and then this souffle I just chopped yesterday actually and I melted some of it yesterday. So I have another melt or two of that left. Um, pistachio bread pudding. That's new to me. Hot pie plus apple. Um, excited to melt this. This is a really good, like, spicy apple scent um, mixed with the hot pie. It's fall, y'all. This is from her most recent pre order. So if I don't get to that, I won't be too upset because I could just save it for next year. Anti-Social Moms Club. I got this in a de-stash recently. It's like a spicy, like a pumpkin spice scent. I think that might be all my teddy bees. Um, I have some, oh, actually I'm gonna do these. So these are my swanky loaves that I want to at least start. So Moroccan mint sweet green tea. I know that's not, um, particularly fall but I don't have a lot of like I don't think I have any swanky like fall themed loaves so I just pulled out some random ones this is in Harlequin Romance um those are the scent notes and then this one is vanilla dream cake this is a delicious vanilla scent so I figured I would have that as an option from, oh, I see some more swanky here. So this is masala chai, oatmeal cookies, buttery brown sugar, eggnog, custard. Um, lemon drizzled pretzel. Okay, that might have been my swanky, no, I'm just kidding. Yoga, this is marshmallow, musk, cocoa butter, warm amber. Oh, I found some more Teddy Bees. So I have a partial souffle in Patisserie and NYC. This I just always have in my melting basket because it's my go-to guests are coming over scent. It's just so non-offensive. It's a delicious atmospheric bakery scent that is just very much a background scent so it's not it's not a powerhouse scent at all but that's why I love this for when I have company I've gone through t 
tubs tubs and souffles of this and then this is my last souffle i have um and then once i finish this i'll break into my loaf um another teddy bees is i heart vanilla pear i think pear scents are really nice this time of year as you transition into fall so i'm excited to melt this i just want to sniff this it's such a delicious crisp pear but it it does lean a bit body care with the i heart vanilla okay i think that is it for teddy bees. Um, we can do, I want to see another swanky here. Another chopped up souffle in moonflower, chocolate, orchid, let them eat cake and vanilla bean. This is a carryover from my last melting basket. I have some parcels which I'm going to go through here. So glitterati, lemon, lavender, shortbread. I've got it chopped up. This is a carryover from last fall. It's pumpkin creme brulee, country cream, and brown sugar. It's really good. Um, I think that might have been it. Found another Teddy Bees. This is balsam and blooms. I have a whole other loaf of this, so I would like to finish that. Some Dessas. I've got mint julep bar, just a few pieces left. I didn't want to put that back in my collection. Shipwreck Island. Another one here is Fireflies. This is a beautiful, like damp atmospheric scent. My goodness, I see some more teddy bees here. So Lost in the Orange Grove. This is a beautiful grapefruit scent. It doesn't smell orangey to me. It does smell grapefruit. Probably have like two, two-ish melts. This is a powerhouse, so that might be like three melts. Um, and then also from Swanky, we have Pumpkin Donut Shop. From the pharmacist's daughter, I have Coconut Crack. I've got Different is Beautiful. I've got Apple Cider Donut. And then I have some loaves here, so five flavor pound cake, rich and creamy. This is a beautiful, delicious mac apple scent. From Salt Mountain Melts, I have elephant ears, carnival cupcakes. That's actually all I think. And then from the Bunny Sisters, I have this, I part of the name ripped off. It's Awful Waffle. It's a banana scent. It's actually a phenomenal banana scent. Um, so I do just want to use that up. Um, from Vintage Chic Scents, I just have one in L. This is Toasted Eggo Waffles. Smeared with cinnamon and sugar butter. I don't know why I read the scent notes for that, but yeah, this is a really yummy, just like cinnamon, sugar, buttery scent. From L3, I have actually a few things. So I have on Wednesdays, we wear pink. This is my all-time favorite. Today is October 3rd blend. I have this chopped up loaf in sugar lavender twist. Um, my goal is to get through one L3 loaf a month if I can. I don't think that's super realistic with the amount of wax I have. Like this bag I've been, I think I chopped up in July. So this will be the third month. <laughs> so uh, we'll see, hopefully I can finish it. If not, it will carry over. I have this custom in fresh baked bread, cinnamon, sugar, cream cheese frosting. I think that was one of Charity's customs. Fuji apple, funnel cake, sugar cookie royale. I think that was one of Natalie's customs. Um, pretzel, strawberry, I just hauled this one. Um, pumpkin, peanut brittle, candy corn, sugar shortbread. And actually, that's all my L3. 
And then I have Traverse City Fall Baking at Tiffany's. And then I have this whole sampler from Swanky. It's the Fall Circus Mystery Bag. Um, I'm not going to go for it. I just, I'm just going to leave this here. <laughs> I'm sorry, guys. I just, some of the names have like wiped off on that, so I can't even read the names. So it's just going to be too much. Um, oh, actually, one more L3 is Caramel Apple Zucchini Bread Cream Cheese Frosting Sugar Cookie Royale. I actually have this going in my warmers right now. It's really yummy. That's way better than I expected on cold. And then the rest of my melting basket is Rose Girls, and I have so much of it. It's pretty much its a whole other basket. Circuit Sunday, I just have a little bit left. Opposite of Keto. Basic Bitches. Boom Roasted. I just have like two small pieces left of that. Oh, and then I'm going to melt that with this, which is Starbeans Cafe. I just have this one tiny piece left. So I'll probably just do these two together um, in my apartment one day. Smooth Criminal. Apple Fritter Donut Holes. Fluff Puff Peaks. State Fair Kettle Corn. Little Red Riding Hood, Streusel Coochin Cookie Land, Thank You Mario, But Our Princess Is In Another Castle, Fall Hike, The Calm Before the Storm, I just added this in for like, I don't know, like rainy days or something, Orange Danish Cronuts, banana bread carbs, and then the rest are mini melter bags. So we've got campfire marshmallows, and I'm gonna put these to the side because the pile here has gotten too big. Deer camp. Lemon maple donuts. Fireside cookies with cream cheese frosting. Strawberry Streusel Kuchen, The Peanut Gallery, Another Bag of Fall Hike, Princess Tea Party, Espresso Donuts at Tiffany's, Macintosh Pancakes with Vanilla Ice Cream, Caramel Snickerdoodle Pumpkin Peanut Brittle, Another bag of Little Red Riding Hood. Deep Fried Pumpkin Twinkies. Cider Lane and Pretzel Day. And just three more bags here, guys. Flannels and leggings. Bourbon Pecan Churros. And Butter Pecan Cake with Pumpkin Frosting. Whew, okay. That is my melting basket. I'm obviously not going to get through all of this in September, but um, I am going to try and whatever I don't finish, I will finish or plan to finish in November. All right. Thanks so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye.